the end of the night, but uh, let's keep it going for your next comic coming to the stage, Brian Casino. Alright guys, what's up, what's up? Keep it going, keep it going. For companies that have fucked up names. Alright? Here it is. The, the reason I say that is because uh, I was at home the other day, I was sitting on the couch, I was watching a commercial. The screen pops up, it says Bad Cock Furniture. Okay, if you didn't hear me guys, Bad Cock Furniture. It's a real company, it exists. If you're anywhere in the entire world, you can come to Tampa and see Bad Cock on the side of the building. The thing is, I have a couple questions about Bad Cock Furniture. Number one, how'd you get your name? There obviously was like a corporate meeting. They were sitting around a table. A hot shot from college stands up and he goes, uh, but he's unprepared, just like the guys in Jeopardy who ring in without an answer. He's like, uh, how about, uh, how about good cock furniture? And the big wig in the back is like, no, no, no. How about bad cock furniture? So they all shake hands and they're like, yeah, yeah. Now they're drinking champagne out of penis glasses. And they're like, all right. Another question, uh, is there any invested interest from Lorena Bobbitt at Bad Cock Furniture? Oh. Now, now, is there a mascot? And does the mascot have balls? Because the thing is, I can see it's kind of difficult. You're walking around all day in a dick costume, but if you have to consistently be stepping over a nut sack all day, it's, it's, it's going to be a problem. It's definitely going to be a problem. Now here's the thing, what makes the mascot so disobedient is he consistently uh, uh, ramming himself into customers that are bent over contemplating a love seat purchase? Is that what goes down? And uh, how about warranties? Do they protect against bad hot couch stains? All right. And uh, I don't know, I'm not trying, I'm not trying to catch to trash the company, I'm just saying I would love to work there because uh, I guess it's the only place where you can legally call your boss a dick all day long. Alright guys, so uh, one more quick impression. Uh, I've been working on this impression for a long time. Uh, it's my impression of Christopher Walken at a diner. Okay, Christopher Walken at a diner, ready? Uh, Mr. Walken, uh, did you order your eight sunny side up? No! <laughs> Alright guys, thank you very much. Give it up for Brian Casino, everybody. Best Walken impression of the night so far.